Good morning, it's Rise Opine with Dr. Lindsay Ackerman. Today I'm going to talk about topical steroid withdrawal syndrome, which is emerging as a more well-known yet still not fully understood distinct dermatologic condition triggered by prolonged use of mid to high potency topical corticosteroids. While there's been significant momentum in the past couple of years in identifying evidence of topical steroid withdrawal syndrome and several trending patient-generated social media posts, Available scientific publications still demonstrate significant gaps in understanding long-term observational data and standardized diagnostic criterion. Recent NIH-led work defined preliminary diagnostic criterion such as redness, persistent burning, thermal regulation issues, and peeling, and identified distinct neuromodulatory signals which helped to identify topical steroid withdrawal syndrome as a distinct diagnostic entity. Therapeutic interventions may include mitochondrial complex inhibitors like metformin or berberine, topical JAK inhibitors, topical strategies for steroid tapering, and even traditional Chinese medicine in some circumstances. In summary, topical steroid withdrawal syndrome is gaining scientific evidence, but long-term studies and diagnostic frameworks are still needed. If you're a healthcare provider, when considering approaches topically for what has classically been a steroid-responsive dermatosis, think twice about endpoint goals of care and how you may get there without collateral damage. Visit itsan.org, internationaltopicalsteroidawarenessnetwork.org, to learn more.